Hey guys, I just wanted to show you something about tips. So if you're like me, you're constantly losing tips. Here's a short stick. Lost the that small tip there just today. This yellow one here is my dad's stick. Rest in peace, dad. Um, and this one has the kind of uh, twist on. So the ones on the ends came with this table. And uh, as I said, this one was my dad's. And this one I think my dad bought for me. This is a cheap stick, but I wanted to get some use out of it. But the tip was off. This hard one came off of this. But instead of, I don't like the hard tips. I wanted a softer tip on here. So what I did was I got some really small strips of leather. So I actually live in Taiwan and my city, it's a mid-sized city called Zhonghua. I don't think there's any, there might be a couple pool halls around. There used to be more in the past, but I don't know any billiards like repair here. So I'd have to go to Taichung. Taichung is a big city. It's like a million people. I don't go to that part of town very often and so I'm not gonna do it just to get my sticks repaired. I don't play that much pool. I don't play competitively. I just kind of shoot around by myself and once in a while I want to have some friends over and I have enough sticks here. If a tip breaks, I mean it could sit there for a year and not get repaired. But I had this leather just sitting around and I got it from a restaurant which is kind of interesting. A friend of mine's uh, his wife's family has uh, a leather shop. They make purses, belts, all kinds of leather products. And they opened a restaurant downstairs. Like the theme of the restaurant is all this leather stuff. So when you have dinner there, they give you this little piece of leather. It's kind of like a keychain. Let me show you what I did. That's what you get from Rootstock, and the brand name of the leather company is Sob Deal. Flip it over, and I think I got four out of it, or something. You make a template with your ferrule, and just cut it. These are not done, obviously. And then glue it on. I used three layers. Down here in my basement, uh, I used a file and some sandpaper. And that's it. tip stayed on for this round of pool today and I think if I were to do it again I would kind of file this down and just make it flush with the ferrule. I would also use the rougher side of the leather as the top. That's all the changes that I would make. I mean it, it seems to be working fine. I don't know for how long. I'll report in the comments.